Careful, man. Well, I'm signed on the plate for Woodsy Paces, but yep. I hadn't been cleared yet, so okay. we don't know what's going on. No problem. So can you t can you tell us what's happening with your situation? My situation, uh, cameraman right there, I don't know what's still my situation. Uh, paperwork has been completed with immigration. Yep. Paperwork has been completed with Basketball Australia. Yep. I signed in, what, February the 8th? Here it is, almost April. So maybe on April Fool, I get my clearance. Maybe. So um, with, with, your, with, your, you know, with, your, with your style and how you play, you know, are they really waiting for you to come, you know, are you like the great anticipation kind of player or, you know, let's look at your contribution to the team. The so, you, yeah, like you still saying, you're the franchise player. I hope, I hope you are, man. I know he took a lot of trash. So, you know, what's your contribution to the team? Like, you know. The great expectation. Well, I would say any team that bring in an import, that import is, 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 is supposed to come in and expect it to play, help the team win. So, that's all I'm trying to do. So, um, me not playing. Uh, person in the field, we could have we could have won at least two games instead of being over. So you know, no no organization want to start over whatever, and you know we're over four, going into a major doubleheader next weekend, and I said not been clear. So you know our guys morale down a little bit because nobody like to lose. And then of course you're playing against everybody else with a loaded team, stacked team, and you know me as a con contributor just sitting on the side. So that's not fair, but at the same time we're gonna be patient. Trust God. I get on the court. Help the team win. I don't, no problem, man. I hope you know you get cleared very soon. Me too. Yeah, and you know I just want to see you out here, man, playing against Adele and guys like Yusuf. You know. Yeah, oh, they superstars at the end of the game. Man. Yeah, yeah. You know they, 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 stuff. they do. Sometimes, you know they do what they do, man. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I, you know I'm gonna just leave it like leave it at that, and I'm gonna holler at Yusuf for a minute. Cool no, no problem. Yo, what's up, Yusuf? What's going on? What's going on with your team, man? Um, we started off strong, you know, three and one right now. So we had a rough one last night against Sherbrooke. You know, they jumped us early with the lights off. So by the time, you know, the lights were on, it was <laughs> we just getting punched everywhere. So hopefully, you know, we can get it together and keep it going forward. So you know, you're talking about the lights being turned on and off. You know, you're a superstar player. You know, you do what you do. Um, weren't you able to turn the lights back on or, you know? Yeah, um, I'm just trying to, I'm not a superstar, first of all. I'm chasing guys like Sadell, Jermaine, uh, Jamal, uh, Jermaine, you know, all the other, Jermaine, my teammate, yeah, and yeah, my yeah. man Jermaine here, yeah. you know, and I'm just trying to, you know, just help my team win and, you know, get it to those guys. Yeah. So, hopefully, we, we, we'll, we'll be all right. We, we, it's going to be a great season for us, and we just got to bounce back. No problem. So, y y you know, with this game that you've seen, you know, against Eltham, you know, the scoreboard is right there. How do you think the Falcons play? Uh, Falcons were pretty good, uh, very efficient down the stretch. They got some, what they wanted, like some really good open looks. Uh, Eltham was right there with them, and then they just, they just couldn't get the second chance points and, and couldn't get stops. So they were right there, but uh, we play Eltham next Saturday night. So we, at least we know we can't, we're not going in blindsided. I know what to expect and how they play, you know, so it helps a lot, you know. Uh, so we should be all right, but uh, Waverly looks great. I think, I think they're the team to beat this year, to be honest, you know. The Waverleys, the Ringwoods, the Bulleens, uh, and uh, the Humes, you know, and, um, I'm f and Corio Bay, you know, and the Whittlesees. Once they get my man Jermaine back, you know. Yeah, no problem. Yeah. So, you know, you've obviously told us the teams to beat. What about your team? Aren't you putting your team up there? Yeah, uh, of course. You know, we're going to be in the playoffs. Um, we have to be. There's no choice, you know. Um, and we got great expectations. So once you're there, though, anything can happen. So one game at a time for us, that's the key. And just turn it around because we didn't do so well last year. So this year, it looks bright, but we... We, we need to just knuckle down, fix a few things, and then try to compete with those elite teams. But we got a lot of work to do as well, you know? Yeah. yeah. Just another question, you know? You've obviously got the Hall of Famer as your coach. How's that, you know, how's the experience of playing for him and, you know, and also being your coach? Uh, he, he copes, you know, I got the most respect for him, you know, look up to him growing up. And um, even now, some people call me little copes for some reason. So um, playing for him, you, there's certain pride that comes with it. And you have to perform consistently because he's a great player. And 
you, he knows he just expects great things and you know even though I'm not talented as he is I just try to take as much as he says and um, just trying to not let him down and trying to get him some more wins and you know because he can't be out there so he's hurting you know so when we lose I take it really hard you know and I just got to work a lot harder this week and bounce back. So what was your what's your record so far? Three and one. So we got three wins, one loss. So, so not a bad start. It could be worse. No, no problem. I hope you know you, you get on the winners list this week. Yeah. You yeah. know uh, we'll be fine, man. We'll be fine. We ju we're just gonna compete and get better every day, just like every other team. And um, but we should be all right. You know, I feel feel like we got the two one two of the best imports. Uh, you know, not including Jermaine and Sadell and them, but and Brad, but the two of the best imports in the league, which is Jermaine and Jamal. You know, they they beast, man. JB, he eat everything. He's averaging like 20 and 20. Yeah. And Jermaine, uh, Jermaine is unguardable. He's a premier guy. He got like 28 last night. Yeah. But, the, you know, so two of the best, you know, bigs running around imports. So just got to compliment those guys and get them the shots, you know, and yeah. do my bit. That's it. No problem. It's been a pleasure talking to you guys. And I, I hope I see you guys next time. All right, perfect. Hey, yeah. Jermaine is superstar, by the way. Jermaine. No problem.